Hi folks, another short video just to show you my um, tumbling polishing machine that I've made fairly recently. Um, I'll turn off the motor so you can hear me speak better. Um, <coughs> basically consists of a plywood frame with the uh, sides, um, two 716 or 11 millimeter silver steel rods. Um, take the pot out for a minute. At the drive end I have a second hand motor which I got out of a photocopying machine um, which came with a, its own uh, dedicated uh, toothed drive and belt. Um, the main drive wheel is turned out of plywood and uh, to get it to grip better I just put a, an elastic band in there um, for the rubber um, belt to grab against. Um, it's a very very simple um, piece of equipment really, um, nothing very fancy. Um, on the uh, drive shaft itself I've got some rubber which is also came out of photocopier. It was a piece of rubber about two inches long and I've cut, just cut that into four. Um, the drive on the drive one and the actual idle one uh, just turns on itself. <coughs> um, it's mounted there just with a piece of aluminium um, screwed down to the board and screwed actually into the motor itself with two allen bolts. Um, this side um, consists of just some roofing um, rubber self sealing washers and just behind there I've got some uh, nylon bushes which the uh, um, the shaft run in. Um, fairly simple um, thing really. The sides are actually let in there with a the router to give them extra stability. Um, so we'll, uh, we'll turn it on <coughs> and then uh, the pot inside there and they have um, 0.3 millimeter pins which turn around and polish everything with a little touch of um, Johnson Baby Shampoo to act as a cleaning agent. Um, got this off eBay, um, I think it was about £4, just a self sealing lid, um, self locking, and you just pop that on the top there, put, put your uh, item inside and it will tumble away. Um, I think the whole lot costs maybe £10 to make that. Um, got the motor free. Um, the pins inside, they're about, they're about £18 for 250 grams. So a huge saving over a, a retail unit, costing anywhere from £100 to £150 depending on maker. Um, does just the job. Um, I'm very happy with that and uh, it will come in handy um, and do slightly different items to what the, the magnetic polisher does which, which I showed you earlier um, but all in all really really happy with that um, so thanks again for, for looking in bye for now